Actually, when I discovered them at whatever age, uh, I thought they was real products. And then I kept re learning and reading about them. So that I must have been about 10. We, we end, like I was saying, we ended up going, me and a couple of friends figured it out, we'd go to a place where we can get the whole box and cases of them and yeah. have the entire series. Yeah. It was annoying to have the new series, not to have the new series. You'd see on the, uh, the checklist card. <laughs> Three hundred. Wow. Would you have a favorite card? Um. Yeah. Yeah. Which one was that? Um. There's two. Sword Executioner. Sword and, the Executioner. Uh, salt and bottom left hand. Those are great. Uh. Yeah. Like I have a binder and they have like a bunch of stickers on them and then the others I'd like to sell. What's your name? Finn. How old are you? I'm ten years old. Nice to meet you. Thanks for coming by. These. I'm old enough to have collected all this different series of them, and, and it just uh, it warms my heart to see them again. Uh, I have over 100 cards, and I think they're cool. Do you have a favorite? Uh, probably the Dora the Explorer, the one that says... Uh, Dork of the Executioner. Yeah. Yeah, that's a good one. They won't let us make that one. Oh. I don't know why. Well, it started because my grandfather was a distributor for candy and cigars way back when so he used to give us lucky packages and we used to take out the stickers keep the stickers and throw away the gum and because you know you could get the gum from the baseball cards and throw away the baseball cards so we keep the stickers and so I kept my stickers and uh, do you have a large collection I do have a do you, large do you collection. still have them from when you were a kid I still have them and I also have posters really how many, how many do you think you have? Um, I have about four or five full collections and a few partial collections and about, I'd say about 20 posters. But I've seen how much they're worth on eBay. Yeah. I did sell one collection once for like, I think it went for like over a hundred bucks. Wow. So. Um, but then I realized, you know, I really shouldn't sell them because I really should keep them. Like you said, who's the shirt for? I'll model the shirt. Yeah, who's the, the shirt, shirt for? The for my brother, and he has a full, uncut sticker sheet. Yeah. Of wacky pack. Did he have them all over his room and? Oh, they used to be all over his dresser. He had a dresser that was completely destroyed <laughs> because it was covered by stickers. I'm sure your parents love that. Yeah. <laughs> Say it again. The the door in my bedroom is still covered with <laughs> childhood. My childhood bedroom. <laughs> yeah, it's still covered with all the stickers. Awesome. Mom just left it there. It's still intact. <laughs> I'm sure. It increase the resale value of the house sure, too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>